Epa! Guys, it's Louis the Boiler Man. Guys, we're here today in Williston Park, New York, and we're getting ready to install this NCB 250-158. That's right, guys, it's a combi boiler for hot water and heat. And since we're Navy certified, who's the best? We're the best. So guys, take this journey with me, and let's do this boiler installation together. Wepa! All right, me Hinton, now that we just finished protecting the floor and protecting the walls, now we gotta get ready to start the actual work. Guys, this is called demolition or the demo. So this is the work that nobody likes to do, but we gotta do it because it has to get done. So first thing is first, guys, we wanna make sure we drain out all the water from the boiler. Make sure, oh, first is the power, my apologies. Make sure you always shut off the power first and shut off the water feed going to the boiler. Then it's time to drain out the water and remove all the water from the, hot, from the actual system. So guys, it's a hot water system, so you wanna make sure that all the water is out the system so when you actually demo and start cutting the pipes, you don't wanna have to make a mess all over the floor. So once you drain out the water, guess what? Now it's just time to disassemble the boiler. So we're about to disassemble the boiler, remove the boiler, and also remove the old hot water. They have an old traditional atmospheric boiler as well as they have an old traditional atmospheric hot water heater. So we're gonna get rid of this and we're gonna install this Navian boiler, which is also a hot water system, but guess what? It's a combi boiler. It does heating in hot water. So we have to rip out all this crap and make all this space to make sure that, hey, we have enough room to store this beautiful boiler. Another thing is guys, whenever you're doing any type of demo and you get everything nicely cleaned up, then the next thing is you wanna put a backboard on the wall. Listen, you don't necessarily have to do it. I would always recommend it looks nice and also it makes a lot, things a lot easier when you start drilling and screwing onto the actual wood. So this is the process you need to do first before you install this beautiful Navian boiler.
right, me hit there. So far, so good, guys. So, as you guys can see in the video, we just finished installing the circulator pumps. You guys can see that we have three zones. The, la the third zone is for the actually um, for the baseboard, the new baseboard we're about to install for the for the basement. Also, you guys can see we got the air separator, the neutralizer. Uh, what else, guys? Uh, we took the Navi, you can't see it, but it's on the, the Navi queens on the sides, on the right hand side. So guys, we still got a few things to do. We got the gas line, we still got to finish up. We still got to do the drip legs on the relief valve, on this second relief valve right over here. Uh, what else? We got to connect the hot water, uh, oh, the exhaust pipe, and the electrical. So we still got a, quite a few things left to do. So guys, but so far, hey, I gotta say, it's a masterpiece, guys. This is what it takes to do a Navi import. This is what it takes to make it look pretty and make it look like mwah, art. So guys, let's keep going. Wepa. It's officially a wrap, baby. As you guys can see, the Navian is alive. That's right, guys. We just finished installing this beautiful Navian boiler. And I hope you enjoyed the video and the process because this is what it takes to install these type of boilers. It's not easy work, but somebody got to do it. And let that be us, me and my team. And of course, my right hand man, Moises. You, if you're watching Moises, big shout out to Moises Medina. Woo -wee! Guys, this is what it is. This is what makes money. And I love that logo because that's what makes us money, papa. So guys, enjoy the video. Most importantly, subscribe, hit that bell button, smash that bell button, and leave that comment below. Because this is what keeps us going, guys. And we'll love to hear your comments, see what you guys thought. I hope you guys enjoyed this journey with us. Until next time, whippa!